Hello and welcome to TrackMyWheels.com. TrackMyWheels is one of the most advanced user-friendly tracking systems in the world. It's been developed using the latest German technology and is designed to assist you in locating and monitoring your car, motorbike or van. In fact, anything with wheels. Our tracking systems have been developed to work alongside a sophisticated software package that will enable you to track your wheels 24 hours a day at a low value for money price that will never break the bank. To help you choose the system that's best for you, this short video will guide you through the process of using the software and demonstrate some of the unique features available from Track My Wheels. So let's begin. Following successful installation of the Track My Wheels device into your vehicle, you'll be provided with a unique username and password to enable you to log on to your account. After successfully logging into the monitoring system, you will automatically enter the live screen where one or all of your vehicles can be viewed on a UK map. The buttons shown at the top of the screen represent individual vehicles which can be programmed to show the name of the driver and vehicle registration in addition to a picture detailing the vehicle type or driver. This makes switching between the vehicles easy. When a button is selected, it will instantly zoom in on the vehicle location. The plus and minus keys allow the user to easily zoom in and out of any location. This makes it easy to view the area and surrounding streets. The button containing the three dots to the right of the zoom buttons will allow you to revert the screen back to the general view which displays all of the vehicles. You can also use the mouse to drag the map to different areas if required. Selecting the next button along will change the drag feature to allow you to zoom in on a specific area of the map by creating a box. As standard, the system provides you with access to five different types of maps. According to preference, you can change the map to show more emphasis on different points of interest. For example, the public transport map is designed to show more information in respect of bus stops and railway stations. In addition to the five maps, you can view the vehicle location in a photographic satellite view by clicking on the vehicle location followed by the Google icon. This can in turn be converted to a view at street level which can easily be navigated using Google Street Viewer. This window can be easily closed to revert back to the original live view. The symbol on the top right hand corner of the map showing four arrows to each corner will expand the map view to the full screen. This improves the overall visibility of the map but still allows you to easily switch between vehicles to pinpoint a precise location. There is more information on the right-hand side of the screen in terms of the location address and the vehicle coordinates with the addition of a recent log of the journey starts and stops. Each journey start and stop can show more detail in a mouse click which will in turn show the date, time and location. At the foot of the screen to the left, you can use this area to switch away from the live screen to view the history of each journey. This screen allows you to view specific journey dates with detail including a green circle to indicate where the journey commenced and a red circle for where the journey finished. The blue line between the two colored circles shows the route the vehicle has taken between the journey start and stop. Similar to the live screen, you can then zoom in to specific parts of the route taken where each satellite trace is shown with small blue arrows. These arrows show specific points where the vehicle has communicated its coordinates to the system for historic analysis. Hovering the mouse over these arrows will again provide access to Google's aerial and street view for further interrogation. It also provides details of date, time, distance, duration and even speed of travel. To many users, monitoring the speed of the vehicle is very important. 
The filter area to the right of the map can be used to break down specific areas of a journey to detail which particular parts were subject to possible speeding. We use the filter in this area to preset the speeds according to colour to provide a graphical illustration of different speeds along the route. Ticking each box and associating an appropriate colour makes it easy to recognise excessive speeds at a glance. In this instance, speeds of up to 30 miles an hour are shown in yellow, up to 50 miles per hour in orange, and in above 50 miles per hour in red. We can apply a further colour to show speeds over 70 miles per hour in purple by adding another colour. Similarly, you can then zoom in on areas of the journey to drill down for further information. Finally, we can leave the history area of the screen to display some user-defined information relating to the device and user settings. The User tab allows you to update the name, email address and log on password. The Website tab provides the ability to change the way the vehicle is displayed and you can use the Device tab to change the picture of the tracking device on the map. From the settings, you can return to the Live screen using the icon on the bottom left of the screen. This software has been designed with the user in mind. A user-friendly platform empowers you to fully take advantage of the system's features. Track My Wheels do not use tech speak or industry acronyms, just simple, easy-to-use software that will give you the information you need when you need it. So, whether you're running a business with a fleet of vans or ensuring that your car is being driven safely by a family member, Choose Track My Wheels as your vehicle monitoring and tracking partner. We'll be there when you need us.